Hey, how you doing? Johnny T here from Glove and Boots. You planning a trip to New York City? Well, you already know local. Me, Johnny T. I'm here to give you the inside scoop, but let's get one thing straight, all right? You're a jerk. Hey, don't get me wrong. I want you to come experience my beautiful city, but you're a tourist. That means you're a jerk. Hey, buddy, don't take it personal, all right? When I go on vacation where you live, I become the jerk. Hey, look at me. I am in South Dakota. I'm going to ask directions and take your picture and not go to work when you're trying to go to work. You see that? Jerk. Multiply that by 10. Welcome to New York City. Boom. You are at the airport. Get your bags. Go wait for a cab. Oh, who is this shady character? Some Mama Luke asking if you want to ride in his unmarked van. Would you do this in your hometown? No, don't do it here. Wait for your cab, dummy. Okay, we gotta move fast. You gotta walk as fast as you possibly can. Eat as fast as you possibly can. You wanna watch a two-hour movie, you'll be done in 90 minutes. That's how we do things here. There's two speeds in New York, my friend. Move fast or get out of the way. You will want to take pictures of this beautiful city I call home. That's nice. But when you do it, get out of the way. If traffic is coming, get out of the way. If you are in any line and don't know what you want yet, get out of the way. If a homeless man is walking towards you screaming, get out of the way. Oh, and uh, do everyone else a favor. Just stay in your hotel room between the hours of 4 and 6 p.m. That's when everyone's trying to go home and you're in the way. If you want the Hollywood New York experience, that being the Empire State Building, the Statue of Liberty, and Times Square, yeah, go watch a freaking Tom Hanks movie, all right? No New Yorker has ever done any of that crap. You want Hollywood, go to California. But if you want New York, come to Brooklyn. Take a trip to Queens. Check out the Bronx. Take the ferry to Staten Island. It's free. But do not get off in Staten Island. Seriously, that's where we put our garbage. We got the best food in New York City. Cuisine from every part of the place. Italian, French, Indian, Thai, Korean, Ethiopian, whatever. You want it? We got it. So why the hell would you go eat at Applebee's? Look, you come to New York, you see the same restaurant that's in your hometown, you don't go there. What's wrong with you? All right, let me put it this way. If you're starving, get yourself a dirty water dog. They cook them in toilet water, but it's a step up from the Olive Garden. Authentic Italian, my ass. Yo, remember before when I said you was a jerk? You are. And that's okay. But only admit to it if you have to. If you are lost or need help, then own up to being a tourist, i.e. jerk. And any New Yorker will gladly help you. But again, do not do this between the hours of 4 and 6 p.m. Please, buy an I Love New York shirt. Please do not wear it in New York. Know that carrying a map and a camera is the same as carrying a sign that says my wallet is in my back left pocket and you can have it. In conclusion, I can't wait for you to come to my town. It's amazing, you're gonna love it. You got questions? Us New Yorkers are happy to help you out. You don't got questions? Get out of the way. Bonus tip, if you want an amazing slice, try the Forest or l &B in Brooklyn. Try New Park Pizza in Queens. In the Bronx, Louie and Ernie's. If you're stuck in a city, man, you may as well go grab a pie at Lombardi's. And there is no original raise.